What I'm going to do now is show you how to add a bibliography. Um, as you'd understand, uh, that's the most important part and um, or one of the most important parts of your referencing and it's uh, also perhaps the most time consuming if you're doing it manually. With Word you don't need to worry about it, you can keep um, adding in your citations as you go and you can leave your bibliography till the very end if you choose to. Um, all I've done at the moment is I've just highlighted those references just so you can see where they are, the references and citations. So all I'll do now is go up to references, click on bibliography. There's two styles, there's bibliography and there's works cited. So um, what we're going to do is I'm going to click on the uh, bibliography and there we go, you can see that it's added in bibliography um, it's added in J. Lewis and it's in, added in Tim Witten's uh, Breath, what a beautiful book. And just to show you how, how we can update it, what I'm going to do now is I want to put in, I'm going to make out that this is another another quote. So I'm going to go to uh, Manage Sources and I'm going to add in um, your friend and uh, mine, Kim Keamy. So we're going to copy that across and uh, we're going to make out that that's from Kim. So we can click there, go to Kim Kimi and uh, Judy Reed. I'll add that in and uh, let's add a page number to it. I hope I'm not going too quickly. You can go back and look at what I'm doing and uh, as many times as you like. So we can see that that's uh, been added in, page 16. Now simply with the bibliography all we do is go back and click update citations and you can see that it's added in uh, Kim and Judy which is just fantastic. Um, if you were to delete um, one of the, the uh, uh, say Tim Winton's um, reference and citation, all you do is just go back and click update and um, it would be removed. What a fantastic tool.